Hello guys, welcome to the English Easier with Eric. In this video, you will listen to some daily English conversations in different situations and places. Definitely, you will learn useful vocabulary, phrases, and improve your English speaking and listening skills. Let's take a look. On fleek. Your hair is looking hella on fleek today. Thanks. I spend a good hour getting it just right. I can tell. It's hella smooth and shiny. Yeah, I've been using this new hair oil that's been working wonders. You should try it out. For sure. I'm always down for some hair care tips. Speaking of looking good, have you seen Lisa's makeup lately? Oh yeah. Her makeup game is hello on fleek. I heard she's been practicing her eyeshadow techniques. It shows her eyeshadow is hella vibrant and her brows are on point. Totally. And don't even get me started on her lipstick. That color is hella popping. For real. She's got her whole face looking hella on fleek. I gotta step up my makeup game. You're already hella beautiful, Bim. But I know what you mean. Let's hit up Sephra and see what we can find. Sounds like a plan. We gotta make sure our makeup is always on fleek. Bay. Hey, Bay, what's up? How was your day? It was good, thanks for asking. Just busy with work as usual. How about you, Bay? Same here. Work is never ending, but it's all good when I get to talk to my Bay. Oh, you're so sweet. You're my favorite Bay. Haha, -ha, I know I am. So, what you up to tonight? You wanna grab dinner together? Actually, Bay, I'm busy tonight. I'm going out with my girls. That's cool. I don't wanna keep you from having fun with your bays. We can hang out another time. Sounds good, Bay. How about we plan a romantic night in together tomorrow? Yes, Bay. That sounds perfect. I'll bring the wine, you bring the snacks. Deal, Bay. I can't wait to spend some quality time with my favorite person. Ah, uh, you're so cute. I can't wait either. You're my favorite, Bay, too. Haha, <laughs> I know I am. All right, Bay, talk to you later. Bye, Bay. Love you. Sip tea. Hey, did you hear about what happened at the office yesterday? No, what happened? Do I need to sip some tea? Oh, you definitely need to sip some tea. So apparently, Karen got caught stealing office supplies? What? Karen, the one who always acts like she's better than everyone else. Yep, that's the one. And get this, she tried to blame it on the new intern. Oh my god, I can't even with Karen. She's always so extra. I know, right? But the tea doesn't end there. Apparently, she got caught stealing snacks from the break room too. No way, she's hella bold. I gotta sip some more tea. Well, I heard that she got caught because she was walking around with a bag of chips that had the company logo on it. Haha, <laughs> she's too much. Thanks for the tea. I needed a good laugh today. 
No problem. Anytime you need some tea, you know who to come to. You're the tea queen. Let's go grab some tea and spill some more gossip. Sounds like a plan. Let's go sip some tea. Slay. Hey, have you seen the new Beyonce music video? Yeah, she slayed it. She always knows how to put on a show. I know, right? She's the queen of slaying? Definitely. But have you seen the new girl in our dance class? She's been killing it lately. Oh yeah, I know who you're talking about. She's been practicing really hard and it's paying off. For sure. I heard she's even considering trying out for the dance team. That's awesome. She would totally slay at the auditions. Yeah, she's got the skills and the attitude to make it happen. Speaking of slaying, did you see that movie I recommended? Yes, girl, it was amazing. The plot twists and the acting were on point. Thanks for slaying my movie night. No problem, anytime. We should slay another movie night soon. Agreed. Let's slay it again sometime. Did you get my message? Hello? Hi Angela, it's Dan. Hi, Dan. How are you? Good. I called you yesterday. Did you get my message? Yes, I was in the shower when you called. I see that you called and I tried to call you back. But I think your phone is off. No problem. I wanted to remind you that my friend is getting married next week. You're still coming to the wedding with me, right? Oh, is that next week? Yes. Did you forget? No, of course not. I already bought them a present. That's good. I want to invite Megan also. Next time you see her, can you tell her for me? Sure. Does she know your friend? Yeah, I think they might have gone to the same university or something like that. I'm sure not exactly how they know each other. Are we all going to drive together? Yes. I'll pick you up first, and then we'll go get Megan. Studying for exams.
Hi, Kim. Hey, Sean. Good to see you again. How have you been? Okay, I didn't sleep much last night though. I stayed up until 2 a.m. studying for an exam. I was up late last night too. The semester is almost over. I've had exams all week. Are you going back to California after you graduate? I think so. After I graduate I'll probably go back home and try to get a job. Do you know where you'd like to work? Not yet, but I want to be an English translator. That'd be really cool. I'd like to be a translator too. But I don't think my English is good enough. Don't worry about that. Your English is better than most of my classmates. Thanks. Where are you going now? I'm going to study at the library. I have to take an exam tomorrow. Me too. How late does the library stay open? I think it's open until 11.30 p.m. Okay, good luck. You too. I dropped your mirror. Hi Tracy. What's going on? Hi, Thomas. I'm waiting in line to buy a DVD player. The line is too long. Why don't you come back tomorrow? I think you're right. They're going to close soon. Let's go get some coffee. Wait a minute, I have to get something out of my purse. Will you hold this for me? Sure. Oops. What happened? I dropped your makeup mirror. Is it broken? I'm not sure. Let me have a look. No, I don't think it's broken. The button came off though. I can fix it. Sorry about that. Don't worry about it. I do that all the time. If it is broken, I have another one in my car. Looking at vacation pictures. James, I heard you took a trip to Florida. 
Is that right? Yeah, I just got back this morning. That sounds really nice. What did you do there? Well, we were only there for four days, so we didn't do too much. We went shopping and went out to dinner a few times. At night we walked around the city with some friends. Did you take any pictures? Yes, I have them with me. Do you want to look at them? Sure, I love looking at photos. This one is of my wife and me on the beach. We had fun there. Wow, that's great. I want to go there too. I'll give you some tips and nice places to visit. Where was this picture taken? That was taken at the train station before we left. Did you have time to go to the zoo? No, not this time. We went there last time. It looks like you all had a nice time. Yeah, it was a lot of fun. The food tastes great. How do you like the food? It tastes really great. Did you cook it? Yes. I made it this afternoon. Would you like some more? Okay, just a little though. I'm really full. Oh. Would you like some soup instead? What kind is it? Tomato and rice. Have you had that before? No. This is my first time. How does it taste? It's good, try it. What do you think? Wow. It is good. Did you make that also? Yes. You're a really good cook. Thanks, next time I'll make chicken soup for us. That sounds good. Did you study cooking in school? No, I learned by myself. I have a good cookbook that I read when I have time. Can you help me find a few things? I can't find my phone and I can't see anything. Can you help me find a few things? Of course. What are you looking for? My lipstick, do you see it?
Yes, your lipstick is in the purse. Where's my iPad? Which one? The big one you recommended last year. It's on your bed. Where's the book that I introduced to you yesterday? There's a book on the armchair in the living room. That's not a book. That's a notebook. Oh, sorry. There is a book in your school bag. How about my new pair of shoes? Do you know where it is? Um, it's in the garden, next to the tallest tree. Where is my laptop? You put it on the left side of the lamp. I did not see it. Sorry, I made a mistake. It's on the right side of the TV. Thanks. Oh, and here are your bouquet. It's in front of your house. Wow, thank you. Maybe your boyfriend wants to surprise you. Read what is on the card. We're not lost. Are you hungry? No, why? We've been driving for a long time. I think we'd better find some place to eat soon. No, I'm okay. We're late so we'd better not stop. We've passed that same store three times already. I think we're lost. We should ask someone for directions. We're not lost. I've never gone this way before. Do you know where you're going? Yes, this road goes through town. It's faster than the highway. Would you mind driving a little slower, please? Sure, no problem. Did you see that sign back there? I think this is a one-way street. No, I didn't see it. I'm going to have to turn around. You can't turn around here. I think you should let me drive. I think you're right. I'm getting tired. Going to the movies. Maria, what do you want to do tonight? I'd like to go see a movie. I heard Friends is playing at the Garden Cinema. Oh, I've heard that's a great movie. What time does it start? 1945, it's a long movie. I think it lasted about 2 hours 40 minutes. Will you come and pick me up? What time? I think we should get there early because they might be sold out. 
Is 6.50 p.m. okay? Yes, that will be fine. I will meet you at your house at 5.30 p.m. Do you want to eat something before watching a movie? I'm not sure there will be enough time for that. We can have popcorn and hot dogs at the theater if you want. I don't like the popcorn they have there. I think they put too much salt on it. Okay then, I'll pick you up a little earlier and we can go to the Thai restaurant next to the theater, is that okay? Yes, I like that place. I ate at the hotel. Hi Mary, did you have breakfast yet? Yes, I ate at the hotel with my sister and my mom. Oh, they have good food there. What did you have? I had sandwiches, fried eggs, and apple juice. How was it? The food didn't taste very good, and actually, I don't feel very well now. That's too bad. Do you want to take a break? No, I'm going to go back to the hotel at lunchtime to lie down. I'm going to the drugstore later. Is there anything I can get for you? No, that's okay. I think if I rest for a little while, I'll feel better. Taking pictures. Excuse me, sir. Will you take a picture of me? Sure. This is a really nice camera. Thanks, my parents gave it to me. How do you use it? You press this button here. Come a little closer. Wait, that's too close. Move a little to the left. Move back a little farther. Okay, stay right there. Do you mean here? Yes, that's good. Oh, I can't get it to work. You need to hold down the button for about three seconds. Okay, I got it. Are you ready? Yes. Smile. Smart ways to improve your speaking skills. Greatest. Everybody on the face shit. I look around and feel like everybody is the fakest. I make this every day and I'm impatient. Hoping one day I blow up from the basement. Statement. The top is so vacant. I don't need shit that I think is amazing. Waiting for my day when I'm playing. Sold out shows for a thousand faces. Hey, give me that crown. Get in my way and you'll be put down. It ain't your place. I'll diss my town. If I want that shit, then I'll get it right now. I'm losing it. The noose fits. Some loose shit. A stupid myth. You choose to live or choose to dip. You choose to fight. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share, 
Comment on my videos. Please, subscribe to learn more English with my channel.